good morning and uh, welcome to the Reserve Bank. Today, continuing the process begun in September, we have announced the following policy measures. We have reduced the marginal standing facility rate by 25 basis points from 9% to 8.75% with immediate effect. We have increased the policy repo rate under the liquidity adjustment uh, facility by 25 basis points from 7.5% to 7.75% with immediate effect. And the liquidity provided through term repos of seven day and 14 day tenor has been increased from 0.25% of net demand and time liabilities uh, to 0.5% with immediate effect. This is net demand and time liabilities of the banking system. Now, let me give you a brief assessment of the situation. Our policy decisions are based on the current evolving global and uh, domestic macroeconomic situation. The outlook for global growth has improved modestly, and the prospect of delay in the taper of the Federal Reserve's bond purchases has brought calm to financial markets. Domestically, while industrial activity has weakened, strengthening export growth, signs of revival in some services, along with the expected pickup in agriculture, could increase real GDP growth from 4.4% in Q1 to a central estimate of 5% for the year as a whole. The revival of large stalled projects and the pipeline cleared by the Cabinet Committee on Investment may buoy investment and overall activity towards the close of the year. On inflation, both wholesale and consumer price inflation are likely to remain elevated in the months ahead, warranting an appropriate policy response. We have calibrated liquidity management to the system's requirements.